Hi, Karen Wells, Independent Sensi Consultant. My SFR kit has come. Tonight I arrived home and found two large boxes blocking my front door and that was absolutely gorgeous. What a lovely thing. So I ripped into it straight away, of course, because as we know it, <clears throat> I'm a sensi addict and I can't resist to get into um, a box. And I've got testers which is absolutely fantastic. I'm really looking forward to getting into those. And I've got both bits and pieces. I went for the Inspire kit, which was the largest one to get uh, both samples of both the Halloween collection and also the holiday collection. So I've actually tried a bar from the Halloween collection already, <clears throat> which came in our whiff box. And, um, We'll get straight into it because it's quite a large box full of goodies. So we've got three scent pods and these are to go in the wall fan diffusers, in the mini diffusers and also your Scentsy Go. So they're just a little pod with uh, scent beads in them and these are the same beads that come in your um, Scentsy Buddies uh, scent packs. And I guess they're the same ones that are in small buddies, such as the um, buddy clips, I assume. I don't know, but I do know that they're the same that come in the scent pods uh, and the scent packs. Okay, so the first scent, these are all apple-based here in Australia. So pie, oh my, which is very interesting. <laughs> pie, oh my. And apple picking. And the other one is Appleberry. Now, Appleberry is the fragrance that I've already tried. That was a bar that came in the um, in the whiff box. So, and in the bar because I've already melted it. It's uh, it's very light for me. It really doesn't fill up my kitchen at all. I'm looking forward to having the bar melting. And putting this in my wall fan diffuser that I've got in there just to add extra fragrance because the bar on its own is quite light for me um, it is very fruity very nice um, doesn't really have enough berry in there for me well anyway it is light it's lovely but light pie oh my <laughs> oh, who makes up these names and it's cinnamon, which is not a bad thing because I drink, I like cinnamon. I actually add clove and cinnamon to um, bars just to add up the spice, um, increase the spices because I do like the spices. And uh, that's quite nice. Hmm, okay. Pie, oh my. <clears throat> and apple picking. And that, I do like the cover in that one. That's a nice cover. Apple picking. Oh, oh, oh I think this one's my favourite. Mmm, yes, I do like that. Mmm, very nice. Okay, so I do actually have my... Oh, now it's gone to sleep. Halloween collection. Okay, so first one is, oh, here we go, in the bar, apple picking. A rusty red wax, and it's wander into autumn woods to gather golden apples with a dash of warm spice, golden apples. Mmm. Yeah, I'll be interested to get it in the warmer. Mm. Yep, golden apples and spice. And that's apple picking. Then, if I can just get out of this one. Oh, not entirely, Karen. Come on, here we go. Oh, gosh. This is why I don't normally do it. It doesn't respond very, very well to. Um, oh. No, I won't. 
don't do it anyway. Apple berry, I'm sure it's just apples and berries. Very nice. And I did melt this last night. Very light. I don't think it's got very much spice in it at all. It's really just fruit, light, fruity, and it's nice. Apple berry. And lucky last, I'll turn you off because you're not going to be much fun at all. Pie, oh my. This is more of a uh, darker, and this has got cinnamon in it. So I would imagine it'll be like pie crust. And apples, probably red apples, I would say, at a rough guess. Seeing maybe the colour is influenced by that. And uh, it is cinnamon based, but very nice. Pie, oh my. Okay, then we've got um, the sugar scrubs. And um, we got two sugar scrubs in our catalogue. We've got butter pe pecan, which came in my whiff box last night. And I opened it and it smells delicious. I don't know what butter pecan smells like, but it was really yummy. It was lip smacking good. I really wanted to get stuck into it. I got some on my fingers and it was really hard not to lick it. Now this one, oh, sorry, I'm just, I'm a bit eager, aren't I? Pumpkin cinnamon swirl. And I, I think that there's just a couple of things. That, oh, this one's come open too. Um, anyway, pumpkin cinnamon swirl. Oh. Oh, oh. That's nice. That's yummy as well. Oh, where am I going to put this? Ah, oh, gosh. And that was one of the other things. I was really curious to find out whether the scents were going to be all the same as what they were in other regions so pumpkin cinnamon swirl mainly cinnamon with a bakery scent oh these scents are just gorgeous how do they get them to smell so delicious <laughs> and what else have we got we've got um oh that's right there was a fragrance flower as well and it was in Apple and cinnamon sticks. So I'm pleased that that's the same as well. I knew it was, um, but in previous years, we've all been given different scents to what's happened, been released overseas. And I've just felt as if I've missed out a little bit. So then we've got the counter clean and also the dish soap in cider mill and cider mill is one of my favorite winter scents um, we don't have it here in australia currently available i did actually pick up a couple from uh, the clearance section when i first was introduced with scentsy which was a little while ago and um, i've managed to get them to last until just recently actually it was in one of my empties videos and uh, I do really like ah oh, cider mill oh that's lovely very good now this is not actually in the Halloween collection as you probably all know this anyway so this is obviously going to be a um, some sort of a release before Christmas lovely very nice very pleased I got that <laughs> exceptionally pleased okay so then um, the sense of uh, the holiday the Christmas release are the same as the States and the UK so we've got three scent pods and they're the same sense as I said very blessed which is I would imagine a berry scent and it's unusual it is a lovely berry scent it's not sweet though and uh, it's a bit tart, so one wonders whether it's got pomegranate and that sort of thing in there. So, very blessed. 
I think I'll like that one. Very nice. I'm not really, although, you know, after threatening to eat the sugar scrub, <laughs> don't usually like the sweet scents. Feeling pine. And I'm pleased that we've got this because we miss out on a lot of the, the tree scents and that's all tree. Very nice. And seeing I'm coming around to the fact that tree scents are pretty good, I'm very pleased. And lucky last, happy holidays. And I was uh, blessed. <laughs> you can say blessed. In, in one of our whiff boxes, we had... Um, Holly berry cinnamon and I held off uh, it must have been last Christmas maybe and I held off and that was in one of my recent empties as well and uh, oh my gosh what's that tickling my nose bad enough other things tickling my nose let alone hairy bits oh okay I don't know what holly smells like but that's really nice again a bit on the tree scent very nice trees and more trees and more trees and the three pack that we've got is also the same and we have very blessed and i want to smell this i know it'll probably be the same as the scent pods although the scent pods aren't always the same but, but it is it is it is it is sometimes the um the pods can be much stronger than the scent bars. Isn't it a pretty colour wax? Very nice. Almost a magenta. Uh, I think that's going to be light. But that's okay. I'll do the same thing. I'll get the uh, wall fan diffusers cranking and the wax melting. It'll be perfect. Happy holidays. Holidays. Oh, oh, oh. These little pesky things. Yep. <sighs> Lovely green wax with a little extra interest. Hmm. Again, it's going to be very light. I, look, I say that. Once they get into the warmer, they can change. Other things. Hidden notes. Can actually come out happy holidays and lucky last feeling pine and I'm glad my sense have um, my um, sense of smells changed very nice very pine and that's sort of like an almost an olivey color isn't it interesting colors very nice oh okay very good all right, and then we've got the same as uh, Perfectly Pomegranate. That is the dish soap and the counter clean. I'm not going to open that because a peppermint's not my favourite. I did actually melt, I think, a couple of testers in uh, Perfectly Pomegranate. Uh, peppermint didn't like it really much. Then we've got two sugar soap. Uh, yeah, sugar scrubs. Perfectly peppermint, which I'm sure is a lovely peppermint. Actually, I might try that. It might be different to the wax bar. I didn't really enjoy the wax bar. Can I get into it? <laughs> there we go. Sealed. Herm what is it? Hermetically sealed? Oh, I don't know. There we go. This one's not going to come open with a lid. Perfectly peppermint. Very nice. <laughs> Smells like toothpaste. I don't know. But having two different fragrances to choose from is an excellent idea because if you don't like peppermint, you can have winterberry apple tea. And I'm dying to get into this one. Oh, goodness me. Very tight fit. And as I said before, I don't actually like these jars. I get whenever I'm using them, I, you dig your fingers in and you get all sugar up your fingernails. And I would prefer a tube, so. Oh, but they are 
This one's sealed very well. It's interesting, the others were. Never mind. Can I get into it? I should have bought a tool of distraction to get in there. Oh, of course. I want to get in there and it won't let me, will they? Uh, winterberry apple tea is a scent that I'd really like to try in a bar. Ah, oh, it's lovely. Very nice. Um, and if you've had the Scentsy Soak, it's lovely. It smells very nice. And I'll be very interested in getting hold of a bar one day. Winterberry apple tea, sugar scrub. So there's the two sugar scrubs. Then we've got two fragrance flowers. And I've got Christmas Cottage, which I'm going to keep. It's going to be mine. And um, a very snowy spruce, which could be really very nice as well. But the um, Christmas Cottage, I've actually used uh, soap, hand soap in Christmas Cottage. And uh, these are beautifully packaged. I'll just let show you rather than just get stuck into it. So you've got a decorative ring. You've got the bottle of oil. And then you have the flower. Now the thing about the flower is it has a new design, which is um, Buttercup Bell. And it's actually... I think it looks a little larger than the other Dahlia, I think it is. So you take the lid off, you put the little silver decorative lid on and pop your flower in there. Okay, I won't open that now. But you can bet your bottom dollar I'll be opening it very soon. <laughs> And lucky last thing in my box is the Sunflake Spin Wall Fan Diffuser. And this one is, I love my wall fan diffusers. I've got my mini fan diffuser in my car because it helps to boost the, um, the fragrance from my car bar. And I've got stack I think and I don't I don't have a spin one anyway so there you go very nice and this one's different because it, it's actually got a light normally the on light just a little outline around here is all that's uh, but these ones now have got lights underneath and this one will actually have snowflakes there's another one out in our current catalogue that just has the flower design, um, which is lovely. But this one is for the holidays, for Christmas. Pop your pods in there. And you go. And uh, you've probably seen this before, but when you've got funny switches, old houses, new houses, you can turn that around and you can put it in anything. With all the mini... Uh, mini um, warmers as well so there you go very nice okay that's my oh it's not my testers how how are we going 19 minutes okay well <laughs> all right so we've got um three of the apple scents the testers which is the apple ever after selection this one here says you've got this bag contains a five wax fragrance testers set. Thank you very much. And this time they are coloured and they are named, which is wonderful. So the first one I've got is uh, Find Your Happy Wax Collection, which was released today. And we've got this one here is... Sunrise with Friends, which is a yellow one. And I think this one's the masculine one. I've seen lots of reviews. It is, ah, oh, it'll be interesting to get it in the warmer. 
I find it's only a little bit of wax. It's really not enough for me to be able to get a good idea unless they're really strong. Uh, I don't really get anything from that. I probably won't be able to read this. It'll be far too small. Let me see. Oh, no, there we go. Sunrise with Friends, Coastal Water, Orange Zest and Driftwood. Well, I've ordered a couple of, uh, couple of sets. So when they come, I'll know. So First Kissed Fireworks is Pink Lemon, Red Apple and Soft Musk. Lemon, that's all I get from that one. But as you can see, it's only a little one. It's not even a full cube. It would be, I don't know, maybe half a cube. I haven't actually, oh, I think I have only once digged one, dug, oh, correct grammar. <laughs> English is my first language, you wouldn't believe that. Okay, so taste of summer is lemon, iced tea and sparkling sugar. Get my finger in there. Oh, this one's particularly scantily filled. Very difficult to get my finger in there. <sighs> Lemony. Mmm, very nice. I'll look forward to that. I'm glad I ordered two cents now. You never know, you know, when <coughs> something comes out and you haven't smelt it before, and that's why it's really nice getting these testers. This one is called Showers in Showered in Flowers, which is a lovely mauvey, very light mauvey wax. And if I can read this one, it is Sun Kissed Greens, Green Leaves, Rose Petals and Jasmine. Hmm, okay, very light, very light. But there we go. Pleased I got it in any way. I'm not, I'm not complaining. This is not a complaint. And this one is called Wild Barefoot and Free. Green Grass, Wild Ivy. Mm, excuse me, I can't read that. That's very small. Fresh Air, Grass and Wild Ivy. Oh, well, I can't read the other stuff because it's not in English. Okay, very nice. And it does smell grassy. But I'm sure the full bars will smell quite a bit different to that. Okay. Then we have Sense of the Months. Oh, oh, oh. Let's get stuck into those. So I've got four. Scent of the Month. And we have <coughs> Lemongrass Ginger, which is lemongrass, citron and ginger. And... Uh, this came in my whiff box yesterday and it's lovely. It is very lemongrass, very lemon, and that's the citron and the ginger. But um, it's, it's a nice summery scent. And I put some in last night and uh, here in my lounge and it was gone by this morning when I turned them on again. Okay. Excuse me. So that was September, scent of the month. Um, October, scent of the month is uh, You, Me and the Sea. And uh, it is sea salt, coconut water and pink sands. Smelt that. I've got it going in my bedroom. I actually got a, a, a little, you know, scent pack. Um sample in the whiff box and I put it in my bedroom and it is very sea salt coconut water and pink sands and I'm a bit of a mermaid I don't know why I don't like the artificial uh, beachy scents but there you go I don't and November's dropped on the floor excuse me <clears throat> it is a uh, jeweled pomegranate and that's the same, which is interesting, um, to over, overseas. And it's sugared mandarin uh, and uh, simmering pomegranate and cinnamon. So this will be interesting. Jeweled pomegranate. Very nice. Mmm, fruity. I can't smell too much cinnamon. But anyway, it's a lovely wax. Bit of a 
burgundy colour wax. And December is Arctic Kiss. Arctic Mint, Fresh Air and uh, Vanilla Clouds. Lovely blue wax. And that's um, interesting that we've got a couple that are going to be the same in all three regions. Very interesting. Okay, all right. Well, that's actually quite nice. I'll enjoy that one, I think. Very good. You know, you, you get a bit scared because some of the send of the months, like, you know, a couple of them I haven't really been <clears throat> happy about. <laughs> but, you know, it's after saying that, it's just me, you know. It's my nose. It's um, my, um, my tastes as well. Okay, so what have we got? The holiday... Sensi 3-pack, okay, so which is the Berry Blessed, the Feeling Pine, and the Happy Holidays. And lucky last, if I can get it out of the bag. And we've even got the bag instead of those plastic ones. These are really nice. I'll repurchase this purpose. Gosh. <laughs> Maybe I should have waited until tomorrow, but tomorrow I'm working as well, and I really wanted to get this out and uh, sense of the season and this is the one that I'm really delighted about because it's the same across all three regions and as I said beforehand um, we missed out on it uh, last year the scents that we got were oh, I mean, you know, they were very nice I had a couple of them in my Scentsy Club for a while because they were very nice I did enjoy them but since I'm actually enjoying the more traditional holiday scents, um, because we don't get them here, I was um, thinking, oh, you know, we're not going to get them. Although, as I said, the ones that we get are nice. It's lovely to get these. Blue Christmas, and I've melted one of these just recently. Orange peel, cloves, fir needles, and cinnamon sticks. I love this one. This is really nice. I'm really pleased. Um, I'll have to get a couple of bars of those and um, I might melt them around about Christmas time, but I will certainly keep it for our winter. This one is Wassail Wonderland and this is another one that I've recently just warmed and it is orange zest, lemon peel, cinnamon sticks and fir needles. Very nice. I know I like that one. This one is gingerbread hugs and that is nutmeg, gingerbread and vanilla. Now I didn't like, mm, I'm going to have people going, you, I can't believe you didn't like it. I didn't like gingerbread cookie. That was yuck. Didn't like that. Oh, but that's nice. Nutmeg, gingerbread and vanilla. Ah. Oh. Lovely brownie colour wax. Good one. Oh, I'll be very happy getting that. Then we've got red berry and spruce. Haven't tried this one. Cranberry, raspberry and blue spruce. Lovely red wax. A bit orangey. Cranberry, raspberry and blue spruce. Hmm. Very nice. I can smell the fruit and I can smell the fruit, uh, the spruce. I'll enjoy that one. And lucky last, this is perfectly peppermint. And it's just pure peppermint. And I think I'll probably use these for, because um, I will get the set. I always get the set. I can't resist a set. <laughs> A sense of the season wax collection. Um, I will use that as a mixer, I'm sure, because it is pure peppermint. And it is a nice peppermint. It's nice and clean. I think I'll use it for a mixer and mix it with some chocolate scents and, and some other scents that I've got there that um, can, uh, can be mixed with peppermint. There you go. All right. Well, I know it was very similar to what you've seen beforehand. Perhaps if you're in Australia and you haven't actually seen um, other people's SFR kit, well, 
I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed getting it and going through it. And um, I'll leave my other haul for another time. And uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Stay safe and look after each other. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.